and to come tell us a lot more about what's new in Mac OS X Server for Leopard, Greg Burns, our Senior Director of Server and Software Storage Solutions. All right. Thanks, Michael. So we've got three new updates today, actually, in server software. And the first one is Tiger Server Universal. This is an update to the existing Tiger server that we ship today on PowerPC. And as the name says, it's universal. It runs on the new Intel boxes. It runs on the Mac Pro and the XServe, as well as the other Intel Macs. And it's actually the first version of the Mac OS X operating system that's universal in a single image. What does that mean? That means that a single image on disk will boot Mac OS X server and run it on both Intel and PowerPC. So, <laughs> if you have a lot of servers and you need to image them, it makes your job vastly simpler. Of course, it gives you access to the power and the performance of the new Mac Pro and the XServe and the 64-bit address space of the Xeon processor. And we've made a few enhancements in the OS. We have improved some of the locking and data structure allocation in the kernel to allow it to scale better as a server on the new hardware. So that's Tiger Server Universal. Mac OS X servers completed the transition to Intel, and that's available now. <laughs>